Hey guys, Professor Bill, Comic Book University, and I'm going to explain Jason in about a minute. Jason Voorhees first appeared in the Friday the 13th film in 1980, and he was created by Victor Miller, with contributions by Ron Kurtz, Sean S. Cunningham, and Tom Savini. In the movie, Jason was a terribly deformed child who was staying at Camp Crystal Lake, where his mother Pamela was the camp cook. When the camp counselors wandered off to get frisky in the woods, Jason is teased and chased by several of the other kids. He falls in the lake and drowns, as he had never learned to swim. His spirit somehow remains active, though, as he sees his mother, who had been killing camp counselors, killed in self-defense by a counselor named Alice. The sequels, and several other mediums, including the comic books, expanded on this story greatly. While many believe Jason to be a zombie, he is, more specifically, an angered, vengeful, hate-filled spirit who possesses his own body, hell-bent on continuing his mother's quest to murder anyone who comes to Camp Crystal Lake. While he could possess anyone, he prefers the massive strength of his own body, which is stronger than any human, able to regenerate, and nearly indestructible. Jason can be deadly silent when he stalks his human prey, and he has demonstrated the ability to vanish and appear somewhere else, like a form of teleportation. He is often considered to be the face of horror, and that's Jason Voorhees in about a minute.